Hey guys, <clears throat> Hafsted Thorason here, and uh, I'm gonna show you today how to make a make a uh, Hey guys, Hafsted Thorason here, Visual Persuader. Uh, I'm just gonna show you a little bit uh, get response uh, how to make a form to put on your website to grab emails and uh, let's just go to my account and uh, let's see yeah like you want to get people on your list and uh, the way to do that is uh, by putting an opt-in form on your web page and in get response yeah, they have this new beta uh, version we can go here to create forms and it will give you the the chance to like choose if you want to use a special app, plain HTML editor or list build the wizard. I usually go for the list build the wizard. And um, yeah, most of the time I just use this uh, this basic version here called blank. And uh, let's see what happens. Yeah, we get up this uh, the screen here, and it says type it says type your headline here, and it, we sign up to my newsletter, and uh, I usually take instructions for user. Yeah, let's just take that out. We can move this here just by clicking on the boxes. You can, it's fairly easy to handle. I want to make this a little bit bigger. You double um, click it, and then you automatically get this size here and just. Yep, and I want to make this smaller, so just put this here. I want to have this in the center. This is a little bit dull, like white, so let's click layout and no style, sorry. Just make it blue. A little bit too dark. And uh, let's have this white. Okay, so this is, this could work. And after we've done that, we uh, click this gear button here and it says, yeah, you can give it a name here. Let's just call this test. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna have it on my. Yeah, let's say if I want to put it in my just my free stuff campaign. So this is a special list I made for my free stuff I'm giving away. So. We choose that and confirm opt-in. It means uh, basically if you want the uh, people that opt-in to get a confirmation email, so they won't get on your list until they uh, get this email and confirm by clicking a link. So it's my opinion better to leave this off because you will have better uh, opt-in rates. And uh, add to cycle and day. This is if you have an uh, autoresponder. So 
you could like assign um, you would have an autoresponder already set up for this campaign and uh, if you want the autoresponder to uh, start on this when people opt in on this form you would um, yeah you would uh, put this here you know choose add to the cycle of day and it, then it will start uh, on the day you choose I have set up like uh, like four uh, messages to go out in four days but in this case I won't do it uh, this is very important. Choose thank you page. Um, this is where you want your um, guests that have signed up to go after they have opted in or signed up for your newsletter. So if you choose custom here, you can like um, set set a URL URL and that would be like. whatever you know that would be like um, your download page you know if you're giving away some free stuff you simply you know a website with uh, with your uh, with the free stuff you're giving away you know if it's video or graphics or you know mp3 or ebook or you know whatever so that would be like your site slash free stuff or something and this here you can like assign a custom URL for your uh, guests that if they're already subscribed they go on to this this web page uh, this is a little bit more advanced uh, I won't go into that I usually don't use this so this is all you need to know for now. Um, let's just say that this would be, yeah, like, uh, let's see, yeah. Let's just give this link. Uh, this weapon, uh, I haven't quite finished it yet, but for this video, I'll just, uh, Put it here to and if they're already subscribed they will go onto the download page anyway so you hit save and uh, we do save and publish we get this JavaScript code and we simply copy this and then we can take this code and um, put this on your uh, web page. Um, let's just go, you know, I'll just show you here. Yeah, let's just make a new page for this. And in here in WordPress, you can also like, of course, you know, if you have a HTML editor, which I also use, but uh, for some of my pages, I use WordPress. Depends on what I'm doing. Basically, um, in WordPress, you can click here, text, and Control V, you know, paste it in. And let's just call this opt-in test. Uh, yeah, let's publish this. Okay, and it makes this link here. Opt-in tests. Let's see if this works. Uh, 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 yeah. This is my blog on my personal site. Um, yeah, it is showing the opt-in box here. So let's just try and uh, see if this works. <clears throat> well, I forgot to 
change this, it shouldn't say label, uh, it should say like sign up or yes or something, you know, but let's see if this works. Yep. And it forwards me to the download page and sometimes it takes like a few minutes to like uh, to like uh, update here on the in the get response, you know. But uh, it should be on the list now. You should have like this email should now be in the free stuff list uh, that I have. And uh, yeah, that's how you do it with uh, get response. Uh, basically, you know, that's just it. If you have any questions, you know, just comment down below or send me an email, and I will try to answer them. And yeah, you can check out my blog or my products, put the link, you know, in the uh, description. And yeah, thank you very much.